Hi lovelies, welcome to Managing My Money with Rosa. Today, one of my favorite days of the month, Savings Challenge Day, yay! If you're new here, my name is Rosa. My channel is all about my personal budgeting journey. It is about sinking funds, savings challenges, cash envelopes, where we stash our money, how we stash our money, and why we stash our money. If any of that is of interest to you, I'd love if you take a second and hit subscribe down below. If you are a subscriber, oh my goodness, thank you so much for coming back and spending a little bit more of your time with me. I can't tell you how much I appreciate it. And everyone, please take a second, smash that thumbs up button down below. All right. Savings Challenge Day is when I pull out a couple of my Savings Challenge trackers and we see where we're at with them. I have a couple of Savings Challenges that are multi-year Savings Challenges, and I have a couple of Savings Challenges that, well, will be done with very soon. It just depends on what we're doing. The first Savings Challenge I have is my Nickel Savings Challenge, and it is where you save five cents, 10 cents, 15 cents, five cents every day five cents extra every day where at the end of the year you'd save 1825 in one day well I have this on a two-sided sheet decided I wasn't a fan of the two-sided sheet because I didn't like flipping it back and forth and I stuck it all on one and when I did that and and if we had done that we'd have saved roughly three thousand dollars when I did when I reprinted it I went ahead and pulled it all the way out to 20 so now we're gonna save about four thousand dollars yay an extra thousand so stinking exciting so with that, we take our change, which is what we have here, and that's a, not a big portion, but it's where all of my extra change goes. I then also put money towards the side every check, specifically for what I'm calling my emergency fund, because that's what this is going for, is for a long-term emergency fund. And that is my nickel challenge, and the money behind it is specifically for that challenge. So let's count our change real quick. That's 325 plus 10 or two, four, five more cents plus 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 more cents, which in total change wise, we have 380. Sweet, go us. I have a combination of things that I have made, reused and printed. Um, just works best for us. This lovely jug is an or is a jug that I got from the Dollar Tree when everything was still a dollar, and I've just repurposed it into housing my change. When it gets about a third of the way full, I'll take it to the bank, see where we're at. So we had three eighty, and now we get to add some cash. So five, six, seven, eight dollars, which brings us up to eleven eighty. Yay! Now the cash does not go in that jug. Instead, the cash goes into an envelope that I printed from the Budget Mom. Love this envelope. I put money in the bank in $100 increments. So right now we have 10, 11, 12, 13, 1400 in the bank. Yay! And then the rest of it is in cash. Just trying to make it work for us because again, guys, this is a long term savings challenge. I've been working on this for at least a year and I'm going to say probably closer to two just because, well, I don't put a lot towards it. All right. So what we said, 1180. Let's see if that's even available. 1180. It is. Yay. We'll do a quick shade in. See guys, this is the kind of coloring that I like. Quick, fast, done. Color away. All right. And that is our nickel challenge. One more box done. Moving on. I don't think we're gonna need that anymore. All right, another savings challenge that we are working on is a home improvement. Now this needs $10 for everyone. It only has $2. It just is not a priority right now, so it really isn't getting anything. But I wanted to at least pull it out and show you that it does exist. And I may even actually raid this and use it to pay down my debt. I don't know yet. All right, and then we are also working on a save 2024 and 2024. This is my yearly challenge. And this purpose is to pay for Christmas, guys. We typically do the 52 week challenge every year, which pays for Christmas. We have grown in family, both in marriage and in grants. So because of that, I decided we needed a little bit more and decided this was going to be how we would help pay for Christmas this year. The goal is to get this knocked out as quickly as possible because I've already started to spend Christmas money. <laughs> so I need to get it done so that I can turn around and start to pay the credit card. Now, not all of this is going towards Christmas. 
what is left from this will go to help pay our debt pay down depending on where our balance is for that. All right, so let's see how many. Oh, and if you've been around, you know I'm not a coloring a fan of coloring. So I found some stickers at the dollar something store, Family Dollar, Dollar General, Dollar for certain wasn't Dollar Tree. I found some stickers that took care of this for me. All right, one, two, three, four, ooh, five stickers. So five, one, they don't line up perfectly, but it was close enough for me. Two, three, four, let's keep going, purple, five, yay! We are creeping in on having all $2,000. Oh, cannot wait for it to be there. Again, I've already started to spend Christmas money, guys. That's an issue. Have to be able to pay the credit card off. So I swap money out behind the scenes when I have hundreds and fifties just to keep up with where we're at. So let's see how much we actually have in here. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 1,000. 10, 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 600, 2, 4, 6, 8, 700, so 17, 20. Score! Score, score, score. So we're $500 away. My goodness, I love it, love it, love it, love it, love it. All right, let's get all of this back in here. I want that in the background. All right, so that is our big savings challenge for the year. But we do have one more that we are working on. We have a holiday savings challenge. Now this holiday is for the next upcoming holiday. So let me put that there. And although Halloween is the next upcoming big holiday for us that we would need to spend money on, I've already funded that enough that I'm not worried about having any more money for Halloween. Instead, I'm focusing on Thanksgiving. This is another beautiful budget mom envelope. Love it. All right, so we need to pin. And we're gonna add 10 more dollars to the Thanksgiving, which will bring us up to one 66. This just tells me I have money in the bank is all. I'm trying to make my money work for me while I save it. So 166, 10, 12, 14, 15, 150, 55, 60, 65, 66. Matches, matches, matches. All right, let's put that in there. And that is all of my money for my savings challenges that we are going to stop today. If you have any questions or just want to say, hey, I'd love if you drop it in the chat below. I hope you have a great day. Bye guys.